KOAT 7 sports anchor Bethany Miller spent time with the UNM hockey team earlier this week. They're a team not many Lobo fans knew were right in their backyard. I think only 10% knew it when we first started, and now we're probably up to a quarter. So I still got more work to do, but, you know, I'll take that improvement. While fans have been slow to recognize the Lobos' talent, the team's been around since 2009. There were some times where I was piecing together a team. We could barely get it together, and I knew that we would just make it if we just hung on a couple years. So this is kind of cool to see uh, such a pendulum swing from barely putting together a team to you know being national champion performers. And by beating some of the country's best teams, the Lobos amassed a regular season record of 27 and three, ranked seventh in the nation in the ACHA and qualified for nationals for just the second time in program history. The first practice we had, I said, hey, here's the first hour of our March to the National Championship. So we knew from the start that's where we were headed. Like throughout the summer, as we gained a lot of the players that committed to this year, we kind of knew come August, like, okay, we're making it to Nationals. It's not really a question. We just got to get there. With hopes to inspire the future generation of ice hockey players in the process. I'm not expecting to convert the city, but uh, I, I feel like it's on the kids' radar now, and, and they might opt for it, and there's a place for it. All right, day one, game game one today, this morning. How are you feeling? So I woke up this morning and immediately decided to take a shower in the bathroom. And it was very, it was cold. And I put my hand there and I waited. And I, wa I wanted it to become hot and it never became hot. So I said, you know, sometimes you just gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do. And I stepped in and I took a cold shower and it was not pleasant, 
But, um, yeah, it's just, you know, the name of the game. Sometimes you got got to take a cold shower once in a while. And then, and then Jack later took a, a shower after me. And, I mean, I don't know if he wants to say it, but <laughs> basically the, the, you turn to the left and the water becomes warm, so... It's just how it goes 